An annual community event is back. Organizers are planning to make this the biggest and best year ever. Yes, we're talking about the Palatka Blue Crab <laughs> Festival. So event producer Janetta Cepalero is joining us now. Welcome to First Coast Living. Thank you so much for having me this morning. I remember we did a Zoom last year, we so did. we're very happy to have you in the studio today. Tell us about uh, the Blue Crab Festival. So the Palatka Blue Crab Festival, it's the 30th year. Oh, wow. um, so it's a long running Florida, small town, big event. Mm -hmm. It's um, it's sort of been legendary over the years. It has water ski shows and um, carnival and over a hundred vendors, um, concerts for three days. It's Memorial weekend, Memorial okay. Day weekend. So um, it was originally done, you know, to honor the veterans and it kept growing and growing and um, it, it's really, we're really glad to bring it back. It's the first year after COVID, so right. it's return of the claw. Re oh, I love that, well, return I like of it. the claw. And I must say, I love your shirt. <laughs> Thank you so much. And it takes so much to put something like this together. So tell us about your role in this and how, what it's meant to you to be a part of this. It's really special. I'm so excited that the city of Palatka has brought me on board. Um, it has historically been run by um, civic groups within Palatka, mm -hmm. and I am a female um, event producer, and I have my own company and I uh, produce events throughout North Florida and they brought me on board and I'm so excited it's a huge role and a very big undertaking You're the first yeah. female event producer first female event producer nice. yes, exactly. Girl yes. power. super excited so obviously you said this is kind of the the big coming back uh, since the pandemic quarantine that kind of thing what other than that makes this year special so this year has national headliners, oh. which is very big for Palatka. I think, you know, somewhere in the mid 90s, they had 38 special. Oh, yeah. Um, oh, we know a 38 special. 38 special. Yeah. This year they have Little Texas, which is huge country yeah. band. Um, Genuine. Oh, yeah. They have um, <laughs> the original Whalers. Oh, my God. So, okay. so I worked to, to comprise this concert. It's over 34 local, regional, and national acts, and they're all free. Whoa. So is it one okay. day though, or is it three days? Okay. It starts Friday at 6 p.m. Okay. And the last act takes the stage Sunday at 8 p.m. And okay. you, you know your music personally. Tell us more about that. You know you know about that. So I'm in a band. You know, <laughs> <laughs> no big deal. Ramona and the Riot. Cool. If you're into if you're into live music in North Florida, we've probably crossed paths. And then before point. we go though, I yes. have to ask why. Um, Blue crab. I mean, what's the significance? So blue crab is, you know, it's it's seasonal. Mm -hmm. It's within Florida. It's abundant. Right. Um, the food is southern, and you know, the crab is in the air. It's the essence <laughs> Tell of me more seafood. About this food. So we got the crab, and what kind of other things? Um, so we so basically, when you arrive to blue crab, we have. Um, free shuttles to bring you right down oh, yeah. in nice okay. um we have uh over 110 local vendors food wow. trucks okay. um dining like paella on a steaming on oh a thing you know i mean a huge massive stage and a full carnival uh, pony rides, water slides. Sounds wonderful. Every, it's <laughs> it's all in Palatka, everything you want. Okay, how can people get tickets or can they just walk up? It is open, so it, there's no ticket. It's Oh, you so did say free. it was free. free. That's right. That's it's open it to the well, public. with all this stuff, I'm expecting well, yeah. to pay. Yeah, so, but absolutely. Should they bring their card then, cash for so, the food? So there are ATMs on site. Okay. Um, they should bring, we can accept cards or cash. Okay. Um, 21 and up for the alcohol, of course. Yes. Um, we have some really fun stuff going on all throughout the event um there are some paid events as well okay. you know um if you want to ride a pony you may have to pay okay. five bucks but well, well we thank can't thank you, you so enough much. absolutely so thank you so much for having me all right you're welcome and of course for more on this head on over to firstcoastliving.net